Hello everyone, very welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Angelica and today I am so excited because I am going to show you two looks, give you my thoughts and give you some swatches, close-ups of the Barbie and Colourpop collection. I just have two items that I don't have from this collection. It's the lashes and one of the lip kits. Other than that, I have everything and I was so excited about this collection, guys. I, I am a big Barbie fan, so I pulled out a Barbie I have in my collection. I mean, I have played so much with Barbie. Um, I don't do that anymore. Well, with my uh, daughter, but I have kept some Barbies. And look at this. This beautiful dress here is like a fairy tale. But anyway, <laughs> anyway <laughs> I have done two looks. I have done close-ups, swatches. I'm going to give you my thoughts. But before I get started, I just want to say, if you're new here, this is a channel that is all about makeup. I love makeup. I love high-end drugstore, colorful neutrals. I love everything. So if you enjoy that, I think you will enjoy my channel. I would love to have you here as a subscriber. So don't forget to click on the subscribe button down below and hit that notification bell. I upload a Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays here on my channel. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy. And with that being said, let's Let's go ahead and get started. So as you can see, I'm very pink today just because it is the Barbie collection. Come on. Uh, this top here, I'm just going to show you. This is from Shein and I really, really love it. And let's dig into this collection, guys. I accidentally uh, ordered the mirror as well. <laughs> I'm just gonna show you. I wasn't supposed to do that, but I was so excited about this collection. So I went to the website when they were launching and was just clicking. So I clicked too much. So I clicked actually, I thought I was uh, clicking on this one, but I clicked like on a like duo with these two, but I don't mind that. Let's dig into this. Are we going to start with the eyeshadow palette? So I'm just gonna show you the outer packaging. First of all, the eyeshadow palette. <laughs> It is very, very small. I thought this was going to be bigger. I'm going to show you. It's a little bit bigger. If we have the small talk here, it's a little bit bigger than the small talk, but it's not like super, super big. So it's quite small, but these pack, they nailed it. I mean, Colourpop nailed it with this collection. I think Colourpop did good. I have been talking about Colourpop when I talked about what I don't want to see in 2021 and I didn't want to see okay they release a lot of things still that was the one thing I didn't like that they release too much but I wanted to see something fun something that inspires me with Colourpop and I think this collection they nailed it uh, they did such a good job but anyway let's talk about this palette let's start without a packaging as i said because these are so beautiful you guys look at this and here on the back you have the shade names a small heart and then here it's palm trees so they have a print inside i think that is so freaking cool and then we have the palette so this is the palette it's the same as the outer packaging and this is how it looks when we open it up you have a mirror here with the sun and it says barbie color pop and then you have 15 shades so these are mattes and shimmers and i think there are different formulas on the shimmers but i have tried every shade in this palette and I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, there is some shades here that is just stunning, you guys. Stunning. Just gonna say that. And then we have the Super Shock Highlighter. So this is the Beach Party. This is the outer packaging. Again, look at these palm trees. Uh, it's just so beautiful, all the details here. And you have the palm trees inside. It's just so well thought of. I'm so, so freaking impressed with this collection. And here is the packaging of this. It's just this Barbie pink and it says a beach party. And when we open it up, it is a really big super shock highlighter. It's kind of marble and you have a big, big size mirror here. And this is a beautiful, beautiful shade. It's like a golden champagne shade. Exactly what I was looking for. And I think it's absolutely gorgeous. And then this mirror <laughs> came with the most stunning packaging. Look at this packaging. This Barbie here uh, with the sunglasses and the palm trees on the back. And also you have Barbie inside here. It's just absolutely beautiful. And you actually got the mirror in this one. So it came really, really, I mean, look at that. It's just 
so cute here is the mirror so it's a heart-shaped hand mirror and yeah it's also smaller than I expected when I was looking at the website I thought it was going to be bigger but I think it's a pretty uh, mirror I don't need that though but <laughs> that's what I clicked on so and then we have two lip kits they have three lip kits but I just picked out two of them so we have the Malibu Sunset and the Dream House lip duo so you get a lipstick and a lip liner and I feel that is genius guys super beautiful and when we look at these packages they also have this prints inside a rainbow and a, like a sunset and the lipstick is beautiful guys this packaging is a light pink see-through and it's also see-through when you open it up and it says like it's printed Barbie on the actual lipstick and it's absolutely beautiful. I'm so, <laughs> I'm so impressed with this. And the lip liner, it says Barbie on it as well. And there are two shades here. So one of them are the Dream House is uh, the one I have to on today. It's like a light, like medium pink one. And the Malibu Sunset is a deeper, like fuchsia kind of pink very very flattering and beautiful and i have done two looks this is one of the looks and i'm also going to give you my thoughts now uh, because i have used this uh the first look was a first impression but i have used this to work now and i have used every shade in this palette and i can say they nailed it with this collection um yeah i don't know how many times i have to say that but the packaging the color story everything everything is really up my alley i think this is a beautiful palette to have now when summer comes i mean you can have it all year round you have a brown here so you can actually do a more neutral look i did that for work uh, today actually and i used this one this one and this one and this one so i'm more like a warm orangey with a little bit of pink and I think I took this one and this one on the lid. Just a very neutral look, but it was so, so flattering, beautiful. And I really love the hot pink here. I mean, it's it's so pigmented, easy to blend. And also these shades I use today, stunning. They perform so good. I am super impressed. This shade is, <laughs> is super blinding. I mean, this inner corner highlighting shade, you can see this from the moon it's absolutely blinding and it's so so beautiful i really love that i really love the pink shimmers as well this one is more sparkly and this one um this one is not that sparkly but it's very very foiled and this one is more sparkly so it has a little like different not texture well a little bit texture but they have like different different finishes and yeah i really like that as well if you want to go more sparkle and or if you just want to go like regular shimmer and then we have the lip lipsticks i mean and lip pencils the lip pencils are really creamy and the lipsticks as well i am i, I mean i love pink <laughs> if you don't like it pink lipsticks I don't think this is for you but for me this is perfect this is like an everyday shade for me and the more deeper one the Malibu Sunset absolutely loved it absolutely loved it I thought it looks so flattering <laughs> on me anyway so super happy about that I don't feel like I have anything bad to say about this collection I mean I haven't tried the lashes and the other lip kit it's the same formula but it's just a more nude warmer shade I thought I don't need that but the super shock shadow no the super shock highlighter I mean oh my god this is this is a highlighter I have been wanted like from Colourpop. I have been wanting these big ones like uh, Super Shock, sh um, super shock uh, highlighters. Oh my god. Uh, in this kind of like golden sheen but they had a few ones but they were like sold out. Now my lashes is just like hanging here. I need to fix these lashes. Okay. Have I had this lash on like... Okay I think I fixed it. <laughs> I'm sorry if my lash just, I think it's not like properly glued, but anyway, <laughs> maybe we can, maybe we can continue. I have to like see if this is looking crazy, but sorry if it did. But anyway, uh, the Super Shock highlighter, I absolutely love this one. This is what I've been looking for, but 
as I said, on the Colourpop website, you had a few options uh, in this like uh, kind of shade, but they were always sold out. So I was super happy to get this one and it's absolutely stunning. As I said, I don't feel like I have anything bad to say about this collection. Um, I think Colourpop did good. I mean, this collection just was a collection that was maybe not for everyone, but it was fun. It was creative. It was well thought through. I mean, they thought about this. They nailed it with everything. I mean, look at this. This is like Barbie. And this palette is like Barbie in a palette. You, you really get the vibe with this one. So I feel like super excited. I had so much fun doing these two looks. And yeah, I think we can go into the looks now. So let's go into look number one. So now I'm super excited to get started. So let's start with the super shock highlighter. So this is the beach party and it looks so beautiful. So I'm just gonna take a dense highlighting brush and when I swatch it, it felt so, so smooth. Uh, and it's a super shock and I have the mirror here as well. <laughs> I accidentally, as I said, ordered that one. So, ooh, okay. This is a really like gold, goldish champagne maybe. I really like that, that kind of shade. I think it will look really good when I have a tan as well. A little bit on my nose. I'm gonna zoom you guys out a little bit <laughs> so you can actually see how this looks. This is very beautiful very flattering highlighter very beautiful i really like this one i hope you can see it looks really really pretty so yeah really like this one so far <laughs> it's a first impression though this first look is going to be a first impression as well and i also picked up as i said a lip two lip kits so i'm going to try this one out uh, in this look so this is the malibu sunset so it's beautiful packaging and i'm gonna line my lips with a lip liner first This is a very creamy lip liner. Let's try out. I have lip liners from Colourpop from before and they are super creamy. This is a beautiful shade, guys. I really, really like this. I love a pink lip, but this is really, really dark. And yeah, really, really, well, <laughs> really like this one. My teeth looks really, really white in this color. I really like this. So let's do a look with the eyeshadow palette. So I zoom guys in a little bit more. I want to do something pink, <laughs> obviously, <laughs> maybe not obviously, but I do want to do that because this is a Barbie pink for sure. So these kinds of pinks I want to try out today. And the next look again, you're going to see, I think I'm going to play with these and more like yellow and orange maybe, but I'm going to start with a Let's Go Party. It's like a peachy shade and it looks really beautiful. The whole palette looks so beautiful. Oh yeah, <laughs> this is a beautiful color. Oh my God, and this is like a really, really intense coral shade and I really like it. Oh my God, this is so pigmented, so we can blend it out, so that's good. It's beautiful. So I'm just gonna work this in the crease and then deepen it up. Probably with that hot pink because that looks so pretty. I have primed my eyes, by the way, with the Kiko Milano eyeshadow base, <laughs> just so you know. I don't know how well you can see this on camera, but this shade it is absolutely stunning. It is more beautiful probably in real life than on camera or on pictures really love this one. So, are we going in with the pink now? Yes, I'm gonna take this Best Coast. This truly Barbie pink. I, I love a hot pink. And this looks just beautiful. So I'm gonna put it, oh my god, yeah, uh, in the outer corner here. 
and then I'm going to blend it out slowly into the crease as well, but not as high up as this peach. I'm just going to focus it in the actual crease here. This is a beautiful shade. I think I'm going to go in with more of that peach upwards and just blend this out. This is also very pigmented and I don't have any problem to blend it. I'm taking more of this one out this oh, Let's Go Party and I'm gonna blend this out a little bit with this peach or coral I would say. Like a coral peach is beautiful for sure. I feel like they really nailed it with this color story when it comes to Barbie. I feel like this, you can really get like a Barbie inspired look with these shades. Uh, absolutely beautiful. Should I just use maybe a little bit of this yellow? This one, I'm just gonna take a little bit on the same brush. I'm just gonna focus it here in the inner part. Maybe I should do that. Just to warm this up a little bit here. I think that is pretty. So I feel like I need to use the pink ones. So I'm gonna take this Follow the Sun and I am gonna spray it uh, with my fixing, fixing spray <laughs> just to get it a little more foiled and not as much fallout. So I'm gonna place this here in the outer part. Oh yes, this is pretty. This is really pretty. And I'm not putting it all the way in. I'm saving the inner part of my lid. I can go all in with this pink maybe, or I can just put like, maybe this, I don't know. What do I wanna do? I think I'm gonna go all pink. So I'm gonna take this one now, the vintage doll. I don't know if this one is like a, uh, as shimmery because it doesn't look that in the oh yeah I think it's beautiful look at that I love pink <laughs> can you tell it is a little bit crumbly I think I took too much of this it's falling down a little bit but yeah I think it's okay I'm just gonna do a very soft look here I'm just gonna take a smaller brush I'm going in with that yellow again just focus on this yellow and the inner part here just blend it out a little bit what are we going to do on the little lash line I think I'm going to try out this boardwalk it's more muted pink I'm just gonna place it here and then I'm gonna smoke it out a little bit I'm gonna take this one again and I'm just gonna focus it in the outer part here of my lash line this is really pretty so now we just want uh, inner corner highlight I think this Kali girl this one seems perfect for that purpose so I'm gonna take that and I have sprayed it and just oh my god oh my god oh my do you see do you see how blind, blinding this is This is like, I think you can see this from the moon. Now I just went crazy with this one. Maybe I went a little crazy. Oh, look at that. If you want a blinding in a corner, probably this Kali girl is, is, the, is the shade you want. Look at that. That is pretty. So I think this is the finished look. Guys, I'm going to put something in my waterline. I'm going to put some liner mascara lashes and then I'll come back and I'm going to give you a close up and then we're going to talk about this first impression. There you have the look up close and yeah, the first look is done guys with this palette and this was the first impression, this first look. I really like this. <laughs> As a first impression, these shades, these are really up my alley. I mean, come on, look at this pink I have on. I love pinks. I 
even have these because I thought this would like fit in this uh, theme, like the palm trees. But anyhow, uh, the palette. I really love this one. So all the shades I used today perform so good. I mean, it's the color pop formula, what I know. And yeah, love this shade. This one surprised me. It doesn't look that special. I mean, it's a it's a peach coral, but on the eyes, super beautiful. And this hot pink here, absolutely gorgeous. This one, if you want like a blinding inner corner shade, this <laughs> this is a shade <laughs> I think you need. Uh, yeah, really love this one. Uh, it's quite small. Probably I said that in the beginning, but <laughs> I thought this was going to be bigger. So I was quite surprised when I got it. But really, really pretty. I put something in my waterline. I put this one. This is from LA Girl. And this is the Shock Wea shock wave neon liner in the shade fiery uh, i thought when i ordered this one it was supposed to be a red but it's not it's actually kind of the same shade as the lipstick and i also put the alor flattery lights 117 lashes and let's talk about these products that i used so the <laughs> this super shock highlighter this is absolutely beautiful i mean look at that that is this is kind of this is a shade I have been looking for uh, in the ColourPop uh, website, like a Super Shock Shadow, uh, in this kind of warm, like a kind of like a golden champagne. But the ones I saw on the website was always sold out, so I'm very happy I have one of these. It's a big packaging, but I don't mind that actually. And the lipstick, oh, let me see here. And the lipstick and the lip liner, really love that. I mean, it's so comfortable. These uh, lipsticks from ColourPop and the lip liner as well. Super easy, very creamy, uh, really beautiful shade as well. So yeah, I'm super excited. I hope you are super excited about the next look and you're gonna see it right now. Let's start with the lip kit and this is the dream house and this is the light, like medium pink and i'm super excited about this because this is a shade i also really love <laughs> probably so let's align my lips with the lip pencil this is definitely a pink i really really enjoy so let's try out the lipstick this is so beautiful <laughs> you saw it up close as well that it says barbie on it like on um, the actual lipstick it's super beautiful very beautiful beautiful shade uh yeah really barbie really barbie pink actually uh so let's do eye look and as i said i want to do something with the turquoise blue and i'm gonna zoom you guys in a little bit and i already primed with the kiko milano eyeshadow base so let's see uh i want to do uh, i want to take this one in the crease i'm gonna start off with this one and this is malibu memories and i think i want to just put this all over the lid and then we're gonna put some shimmer on so I'm just like Packing it on here, like all over. And then I'm gonna start to pull in this a little bit upwards. I think I wanna do kind of a halo eye with this one. And I want the orange and the yellow under my eyes, like under <laughs> on the lower lash line, I mean. A really pretty color, it goes on really nice really is a great color story as I said before I mean this turquoise blue it's just it's just perfect were you excited about this collection because I was super excited I mean I as I said I think I said it in the makeup releases video that I talked about this collection I told you guys that I played with Barbie a lot when I was young. I'm just gonna do like this. When I was young and I actually still play with Barbie because my daughter uh, wants to play with me uh, because, because she is the 
only child so I feel like I have to play with her sometimes and like she really loves to play like like family <laughs> with dolls but I prefer actually to play with Barbies just to dress them and all that and I have actually made a Barbie house uh, myself and to her and I'm quite proud of that uh, it actually looks really pretty and yeah so <laughs> I still play with Barbie. <laughs> so let's go in with, I think in my inner and outer corner, I'm going to take this and I'm going to take the gold just in the middle here, but I'm going to start with Surf's Up. This seems like a gorgeous shade. Uh, I'm going to take a pencil brush and I'm also going to spray it. So yeah, I actually play a little bit with Barbie from time to time, but I I've always loved to like dress the Barbies. I know my mother, she also loved like uh, making clothes to Barbies like sew because she was like a, she, her job was to sew. <laughs> I don't know what you call it, but she actually did beautiful clothes to my Barbies and my sister's Barbies. So I still have those clothes and really really beautiful clothes she made so yeah I just think she loved to do that as well <laughs> maybe not play with Barbie but make clothes to Barbie I can see why such a fun way to be creative this is a beautiful shade this shimmer shade it has a little bit of fall though I can feel that but I think I pack my brush too <laughs> heavy here but it's absolutely magical this chain. I hope you can see. I just kept the middle here. I'm just gonna use my finger actually because I want it quite soft. So I'm gonna take this come on. Ooh, it feels really really smooth. So it's a gold one and I'm just gonna ooh that is pretty. Maybe I need like a shade in the very middle but I think that <laughs> that looks really pretty very intense wow i'm just gonna tap it a little bit so you can just blend it out a little bit it's actually nice to use your fingers when you don't want it to be too precise but i'm gonna take more of that serves up almost the turquoise just to clean up a little bit here because we do want that as well. I'm going to take the brush we had with the mat. I'm going to go over this. I'm going to take a small brush and I'm going in with this blinding shade right here. I'm just going to take that kind of in the center of this. Just do a little bit of sparkle here. That is going to be a very, very, very soft look here. I want orange and yellow, as I said, uh, under my eyes. So I think I'm going to start off with, or I'm going to start off with this one, the West Coast. And I'm going to put it underneath here. And then I'm going to take a flat brush and now we're going in with this orange here. And I'm just putting it very close here to my little lash line. And we're gonna blend this a little bit together here. I think this is pretty cool. I mean, you really need some lashes to this, so I'm gonna put this in my inner corner as well. I really love this shade to be like an inner corner highlight because it's so, so freaking blinding, this one. Okay guys, and now I'm done with the look. I'm gonna put something more <laughs> I'm gonna put something on waterline, uh, lashes mascara, and I'll come back and I show you the finished look up close. I put this one in my waterline, I put the ColourPop. <laughs> Uh, cream gel liner in 
puppy. Uh, it's orange one and I also put these lashes. These are from XO Beauty and these are the, let me see here, I think this is the, the cheek. Uh, lashes and yeah that was it guys i hope you have enjoyed this video and what do you think did you pick this uh up this collection or maybe just an item two items tell me down below uh were you excited were you as excited that i was <laughs> In this collection because this made me so excited uh, not gonna lie it was like uh, I really needed to get this one and yeah that was it guys I really hope you have enjoyed it as I said and don't forget to subscribe and I see you in my next one take care guys bye